All right, it's the morning after I just got back from Reno, Monday, um, walking into weights about 7.30, had a good time, Reno was awesome, uh, one of the coolest experiences, it's kind of like my first time to, uh, to Gotsis and, and seeing what it was like to have just this one, one meet centered around this one thing and having so many passionate fans uh, supporting it. Spirit's been awesome uh, to me, uh, my collegiate career, professional career. Uh, can't thank them enough. The fans were awesome. I really, really, really needed that meet. Uh, not only just to get some technical work in, but to kind of get out of those like training doldrums, to get out of that kind of monotony of just waking up every day, training going home every day, sleeping, that kind of stuff, not getting that that little kick, that little little bit of edge, that little bit of adrenaline that I, you know, I didn't get a chance to do hardly at all last year. I didn't get to compete that much, so this was awesome. I kind of feel like I got some of my competitive juices going, and it's really, I don't know, it's going to kickstart the season. Um, yeah, got to clear a bar. Third attempt at the bar again this year, opened it uh Open at 5:20. Hopefully, there's some video uh, that'll be posted out there pretty soon. Um, didn't look good at all, but uh, clearing bars are clearing bars, so I'll take it. Uh, something to build on, something to work on, and uh, yeah, that's it. First competition down. I think my next competition will actually be a heptathlon in Estonia. Really excited to go over there. Excited to get to compete in seven events now instead of just the one. Um, all my other events are progressing really well. Uh, dare I say, I think I'm, I'm faster than I've ever been at this point in my in this part of the year uh, in my career. Um, definitely stronger than I've ever been, uh, and that's kind of scary because we're not we're not really putting a lot of eggs in those baskets yet. Um, really going to spend the the last part of indoors working on those things so uh it's kind of exciting kind of exciting after after the heptathlon uh in in february we'll head straight over and, and do milrose i'm gonna go up head to head against ashton i think we're gonna run the hurdles in pole vault uh it's two of he and mine's uh best events so that'll be awesome that'll be really fun good build up for uh for the indoor championships in sopot and that's pretty much it. Those are the updates. I just wanted to put something out there uh, after Reno. I'm just pretty excited. Pretty excited about the rest of the season. I don't know how much longer I'm going to keep this mustache. <laughs> I'm looking at myself in the camera. And it's it's a lot worse than how bad I think it looks, too. Uh, all right. Good luck to everybody, uh, the rest of this indoors. And hopefully you'll be hearing from me soon.